Welcome back to Disney Dreamlight Valley. I'm Dee's Angel. I'm just resting real quick. Dee's Angel, I've been thinking about Olaf. Um, he's a sweetheart. <laughs> I'm also very fond of him. Uh huh. He was the first living being I made out of snow. I've started being more careful about making life. Uh, that's smart. No, make an army of tiny snowmen. You know what? Let's try that one. No, make an army of tiny snowmen. <laughs> I kind of already did. I had a cold, and I accidentally made snowmen when I sneezed. <laughs> there are a lot of them, and I feel responsible for all of them. Probably no more living snowmen for a while. That was fun. <laughs> I was sitting here on the tree, and... I found that I was able to regain a lot of my energy just like going home. That was really neat. And I was trying to capture that and Scar was being really snarky talking to me. Hi! Hi, Mirabelle. What are you up to today? Mm. Dee's Angel. I'm thinking about adding some new embroidery to my skirt. Mm. Mm. Wow. Can you get much more in there? What do you think I should add? Um. Hmm. Well, she's well, got her name, Mirabelle. She's got flowers. Another butterfly. Good call. <laughs> you can never have enough butterflies. Nope. We can't. definitely have to talk again soon. All right. We'll talk again soon later. Okay. So, we can't do anything more with the good gravy with the aliens for today so let's see what else we have so Buzz has another quest so let's go see if we can find Buzz there's Woody There he is. He's down here on the beach. All right. There he is. Hey, Buzz. I have a very important job for you. You do. Cadet, on our last mission, we learned... No. In fact, you helped me remember that being a hero isn't just about battling villains. This is true. Would you have time to offer further assistance along those same lines? Okay. <gasps> Look at Ursula's being pushy with Ariel. That's rude. Um, sorry, Buzz. Um, yes. Yes, I would. Um, I'm listening. In our debrief at the end of our last mission, you told me that heroism is about giving others a chance to be better. Yes. But I didn't give Ursula the benefit of the doubt the last time I dealt with her. Hmm. I've got to make things right. I just don't know how. Well, heartfelt apologies go a long way. What would you expect from someone else? And you were wrong, you were wrong Buzz. Just apologize. Hmm. Well, what would you expect from someone else? And heartfelt apologies go a, a long way. Heartfelt apologies do go a long way. I had a feeling you were going to say that. And you're right. Uh. Though I had hoped there was a less uncomfortable way out. Uh -huh. Oh my goodness, Ursula. Well... I know what I have to do. Ahem. <clears throat> Dee's Angel. I don't suppose you'd come with me. It'd be good to have some backup. Sure. The definition of a hero. Alright. So Buzz is going to apologize to Ursula. Ugh. What is it now? What horrid deed have I done to deserve another visit from you? I, uh... I wanted to apologize. Really? Well, my dear, I'm all ears. Ursula, I'm sorry. 
I shouldn't have assumed you were up to a nefarious scheme. I hope we can be good neighbors in the future. As far as apologies go, that was pitiful. But I suppose it'll have to do. Now, off you go. Mustn't overstay your welcome. Oh my. Hmm. You've got style, my friend. <laughs> I'm glad I cleared the air with Ursula. Dee's Angel, this journey has given me an idea. We should open a Star Command Academy to train other protectors of the valley, whether they were a hero or a villain in the past. Let's start with three recruits. Of course, they'll need Space Ranger badges. In fact, that can be your next mission. You'll have to make blue ink before you can make the badges. The, ingredient, the ingredients are easy to locate. I trust you'll have no problem. Report to me with the badges when you're done. I'll start thinking about who we should recruit. Hmm. Okay. All right. So, iron ingot, three, fabric, three, and then craft some blue ink. Okay. Well... Are you still bullying Ariel? I can't even get there. <gasps> I Hi, just Ariel. love watching the human world. Oh, hello, Dee's Angel. Um, you seem to be looking at the well. Mm. Dee's Angel, does anyone ever drink from the wishing wells in the valley? Um, I don't know. Why? Well, I always try to avoid them when surfacing in the village so I don't startle anyone. Oh, that's probably a very good idea. I will keep avoiding them, just in case. Sounds good. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Ursula? Hello, dear. Hello, dear. Mm, what are you working on? Yes. I need a new potion to attract customers, D's Angel. What sort of magical potion do you think would be most in demand here? Well, mm. I've certainly gone into the unknown. <laughs> um, well, we tried love before. How about luck potion? Luck spells are tricky, but they do sell well. Not a bad idea. Now scram! Angelfish, don't forget to visit me. Okay. You're here! Finally! Uh, yes? Just who I was hoping to see. Really? Um, what would you like today? Blue falling pestamen, gray stuff, and a Mediterranean salad. Well, I don't have anything. But maybe we can get stuff and we'll come back. Alright. Have we got a deal? Uh, wait. I didn't make a deal. So, no. No deals. No deals, Ursula. Oh my goodness. Her and her scheming. Okay, let's see. Um, blue ink. We need two blue hydrania, three blueberries, and an empty vial. Good thing we have all. Okay. Oh, we need three of them. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> um, nope. Functional. Wasn't it functional? Yes, it was. All right. Let's try two more. Yeah. Okay. Craft the Space Ranger badges. Three of them. Oh, it's going to rain. Okay. Is it a functional item? It is. Space Ranger badge. So... We need three, so we need three iron ingots, three pieces of fabric, and then the three blue dye. Okay. And now we just have to go talk to Buzz. And he is just off to the edge over here. Yeah, that's right. 
The ocean's a friend of mine. <laughs> hey, Buzz. <laughs> Astounding cadet. These space ranger badges look very authentic. Thank you. Now, we just need to decide who to recruit for our Star Command Academy. Okay, well, we need someone who provides that heroism comes in small packages. Oh, who proves that heroism comes in even in small packages. That's Remy, of course. Plus, he can cook for everyone. <sighs> Hopefully, he won't mind having to prepare air tea and air crumpets for some of us. <laughs> okay, who else? We need someone who's a seasoned explorer. That sounds like Moana to me. I've heard about her travels. Very impressive. Okay, who else? Well, we need someone with a little bite. Like Scar. He keeps that old badge. He kept that old badge for so long. He's practically already a space ranger. Yeah. <laughs> I like your thinking, Deez Angel. Well, I'd say you're ready for your first recruitment mission, Deez Angel. Good luck. All right, thank you. Wow, my skin is very dark. Hmm. I must have gotten quite a tan. Hey, Moana. Um, here is a Space Ranger badge. Hello. Hello. Hey, Dees Angel, what sort of adventure are we going on today? Well, Buzz and I would like to invite you to join our new Star Command Academy here in Dreamlight Valley. Uh, we need your Wayfinder ex expertise. You'd learn more about the stars. You could help the village. Um, you'd learn more about the stars. Really? Yeah. That would be amazing. Uh, oh, but I'm really more of a sea voyager. Are you sure it would be a good fit? Well, you left your island to save it when you didn't know much about sailing. That's the definition of heroism. You'd learn how to be a space ranger the same way. That's the kind of boldness we need. That is the kind of boldness we need. <laughs> huh. That was kind of bold, wasn't it? It was. And it does sound like an interesting new journey. Ah. All right, Deez Angel. I'll try it. Nice. Just find me later. I'll I definitely be around. All right. I hope you know how amazing you are. Aw, thank you. Okay. Now we just need to go talk to Remy and Scar. Hmm. Let's see. Is Remy in the restaurant? I can't tell. But I know Scar's up here. So we can go see Scar real quick. Oh. Our skin tone went back to normal. Okay. I didn't mind the tan. Hey, Scar. You there. I need you. Oh, oh, good. Um, here is a Space Ranger badge just for you. It's about time. You again. Oh, goody. What's this? Another Space Ranger badge? Why would you bring me this, Dee's Angel? I've no desire to start a collection. Well, Buzz and I would like you to join our new Space Ranger Academy here in Dreamlight Valley. You know, since you and Buzz are already such good friends, I thought you'd like to be invited to get you out of your cave a little. Hmm... I thought you'd like to be invited. I have no idea how you came to that conclusion. Why would you possibly want me in your little academy? Uh, I 
trust there's good in you. Everyone should have a everyone should have a second chance. We need someone a little ruthless. Everyone should have a second chance. <laughs> Which presumes I've done something wrong. Look, if you won't do it to help others, do it to help yourself. You'll earn the respect you deserve from the other villagers. And there'll be lots of food on offer. Well, when you put it that way. Fine, Dee's Angel. I'll join your little club. <laughs> now, Shu, I'm done with you. I'm surrounded by fools. Oh, my. Okay, Remy, where are you? Okay. I'm... I'm going to guess that he's up probably at the restaurant or near there because I don't see him out and about. So more than likely, he's probably in the restaurant. Let's head that way. Best way to find out is to go. Is it so we can help some customers? Hmm. All right. What do we need? Cheesy, crispy, baked cod, peanut butter sandwich, and a vegetarian pizza. Okay. Cheesy, crispy, baked cod is cod, wheat, and cheese. Peanut butter sandwich. Hmm. Peanut butter sandwich. There we go. Peanuts and wheat. Vegetarian pizza. It's probably a meal. Mm. Vegetarian pizza. A vegetable, any vegetable, any vegetable, tomato, cheese, and wheat. And this one, we're going to use lettuce. A four star meal or better. Very nice. Okay. Alright. Hey, Mother. Hello. Dee's Angel. What brings you to see Mother today? Um, you seem to have a lot on your mind. Dee's Angel. Good. Let's talk through a purely hypothetical situation. If you were, say, tracking your wayward daughter through the forest, huh? how would you convince her to come home? Hmm. Try asking her nicely. Uh huh. Yes, I'll just ask her politely to stop acting out and sit in her tower like a, a, a little good, like a good girl. You've obviously never met a teenager. <laughs> ta ta. <laughs> Oh, hello, dear. Dee's Angel, what brings you to see Mother today? Uh, I have your order. Here you go. <laughs> Is this really the best thing that you can think to give me? Just kidding, darling. I love it. Hmm. Ta-ta! See ya. Hey, Nala. Hello. Hello. It's nice to see you. So, Nala, what are you up to? Dee's <laughs> Angel, just who I was looking for. Oh. When Simba and I were cubs, we used to wrestle all the time. It's great exercise and training, and pretty fun, too. What? 
But since I always beat him, Simba refuses to practice with me anymore. Would you help me practice? Um, I, I don't think that's a good idea, Nala. I don't have claws. I'm much smaller than you. I'm terrible at fighting. Well, I, I don't have claws. <laughs> I'd never use my claws in wrestling. Ew! It's just practice. I don't want to actually hurt anyone. <laughs> <sighs> I guess you're right. It's probably a bad idea. If you think of any way I can practice, please let me know. Thank you. I, I sure will. You're welcome. Hi. Hi. Wait up. I have your order. Here you go. One peanut butter sandwich. This is nice. Thank you. You're Goodbye. Welcome. Bye. Hey, 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 good to see you. Hey, D's Angel. Um, I have your order. Here's a vegetarian pizza. Right for you. Oh wow. Huh? That's really thoughtful. Hmm. See ya. See ya. Okay, well, it looks like Remy is not here. So let's try going into his apartment and seeing if he's there. Remy, are you home? No, but maybe he will appear because we came to his house. Oh, a butterfly did, but not Remy. All right, let's look again. Where might, oh, he's in Scrooge's. That makes it very convenient and easy. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> Hi, Remy. Here is a Space Ranger badge just for you. Hmm. Hello. Hey, D's Angel. What can I do for you today? Got a special order? Well, uh, Buzz and I would like to recruit you for our new Star Command Academy. I think you'll be good. It'll be good for you. Think of all the recipes you could come up with. You really need a new hobby. <laughs> think of all the all the recipes you can come up with. True. I could create a new dessert for every meeting. Talk about a challenge. Bull? But aren't the space rangers big, tall heroes? Not sure if I'm exactly Star Command material. Heroism comes in small packages too. That's never stopped you from doing anything. Height isn't what is important isn't what's important. Well, heroism comes in small packages too. You think so? I do. That's pretty inspiring. Hmm. I've been thinking about getting involved in some village activities lately. This opportunity is too good to pass on. Sign me up. Nice. Thanks. You're welcome. All right, now we gotta go find Buzz. And the rain has stopped. Very nice. All right, Buzz, there you are. Let's see if we can head him off. And he's running. And there's Nick. Woohoo! Excuse me. Hello. Hello. Hi, Buzz. Uh huh. Are our recruits ready to join the rank of Star Command? Uh, ready and impatient. I recruited each of them personally. Scar was a little reluctant. Um, I recruited each one of them personally. Good job, cadet. There's a special role for each of them with Star Command, and I'm sure you let them know just what it would be. There are only a few things left to do. Let's make sure our headquarters appears inviting and that our uniforms are in top-notch shape. I suggest a proper landing pad for our space, or our, for our ship. Asphalt would work. And a blue balloon arch for the ceremony. I'll leave that to you. Once the items are complete, 
Let's put them around the RV. I, uh, I mean, Star Command, so it's ready for the welcoming ceremony. Okay. <laughs> to infinity, sir. Oh, pretty white flower. Okay, so we need to make asphalt. Oh, we have another egg. Nice. Be nice if a little alien just popped up too. All right, asphalt. Asphalt is sand, pebbles, and coal. And how much did we need? We need 20 total, and we have two, so we need 18 more. Okay. Whew! Okay, let's go. Okay, and now we need a blue and silver balloon arch. Oh, goodness. Okay. Blue and silver balloon arch. 10 iron ingots. Uh, 20 blue star lilies. 20 blue falling pestamen. And 20 blue marsh milkweed. Wow. Good thing I was collecting some of these blue star lilies. All right, let's go. Um, did I not make a blue and silver balloon arch? Hmm. Yeah, we did. Okay, so. He wants it over here in front of the R RV. Oh, goodness. Um, hmm. All right. Uh, really nice little tree. Can I, can I move you maybe to maybe somewhere, say here? Okay. Maximum number of different items have already been placed. All right. So we need to remove some items. So does this count? No. Hmm. Okay. Still 604. Okay, well, what exactly counts? Does this count? No. Hmm. Okay. Who's taking this one out? No. Hmm. I didn't think we had that many items down. We haven't done really any decorating over here. Hmm. this one stand for? 603 of 600. So, hmm. Well, let me do some research and I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. 
All right, I got us down to 596. What I basically did was I went around and kind of deleted a lot of extra trees. And then I came here into um, the water and I found that there was like all these extra reeds that were in here as a decoration. So I deleted those and then there was extra grasses that were in here as decoration. Like right now, none of these come up. So these ones are all like part of the main piece, but I deleted those. And as soon as I started to delete those, then this number count went down. Um, yeah, see, those are all part of this amount in here. And then there wasn't anything extra in here. So that's what kind of brought that down. Um, just eliminating a lot of different types of varieties of trees kind of helped to bring it down, uh, as well as a bunch of little tiny small rocks. So, okay, so let's go ahead and come back, and I don't think this Easter egg is going to cause us a problem. I also went and I tried to pick up all of the sticks. Oh, look, see, I, I missed a rock. So if I take this and I remove it. You know, it counts for both in these total items as well as up in here. So, all right. So let's go back to in front of Buzz's RV here. Um, balloon arch. So I guess we could put the balloon arch here and the asphalt. There. Um, oh goodness. There we go. All right. Asphalt is down. The balloon arch is down. Blue and silver balloon arch. It does not recognize that it's there. Why? Hmm. I guess we'll have to create another one. Okay. Maybe there was a different one that we didn't make or we created that was incorrect. Blue and silver balloon arch. So now we don't have enough blue star lilies. Hmm. All right, well, let's go to the, oh goodness. Glade of Trust. Grab flowers. We're just going to gather as many as we can because if we don't find enough blue ones, oh, there's a nice blue one. It helps to, you know clear out an area so that they can respawn faster. show you. Let's see if it happens again. 
Yeah, so you can sit here on the branches and look, our energy is going back up. Uh, you know, it's kind of like going into your house. I mean, obviously going into your house is much faster, but I, I think this is great. I mean, at least you're out, you're enjoying, you know, the weather outside. It's, it's great. I see Buzz over there. Maybe we should ask Buzz to come and hang out with us. That way we won't lose him. in the branches. Mm -hmm. Careful, Buzz. <laughs> He's as big as you are. You've got style, my friend. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, no. I, I can't take care of you. Um, to infinity and beyond. Yes. Hey, Buzz. Greetings. Um, is there something on your mind? Dee's Angel. I have some knowledge of intergalactic travel. Oh, but I wonder if I should learn more about traveling the seas so I can look out for dangers in the water around the valley. Mm -hmm. What do you know about ships of a more nautical nature? Mm -hmm. Well, you'll need a boat like Moana's and a sail. Harnessing the power of the wind. Right. But considering I'm a foot tall, I'm not sure I'd be able to steer properly if the winds get too powerful. I'll have to search for a toy-sized solution to this challenge. Sounds good. This valley appears to be approaching optimal condition. Oh, wonderful. Let's hang out. Roger that. Nice. All right, we are collecting flowers. Yeah, I tried everything to reduce that number. I went and dug up all the spots. I wonder what Anna's up to. Mm, I'm not sure. Um, I haven't seen her in a few minutes. But I went and I dug up all the sparklies on the ground. I tried to collect all the sticks. I tried to collect all of the garlic. Uh, it's, it was crazy. Okay, let's try making this arch once again. Hopefully we have enough. It looks like we do not. Blue star lily. Hmm. Oh, we were collecting maybe the blue marsh milkweed. Blue star lily. All right, where are the blue star lilies? Blue star lily is in the forest of valor. Okay, oh, let's go back to the forest. I was in the wrong spot and I hit the wrong button again. I'm all flustered. Hmm. I wonder, does, why does this not acknowledge it? Let me talk to Buzz. Greetings. Um, definition of hero, what's next? We need to place everything around our base for the ceremony. That's a landing pad for our ship using asphalt. And the blue balloon arch, everything must be installed near the RV. Er, Star Command Headquarters. Okay, well maybe I'm just not close enough with this balloon arch. Maybe it needs to be closer. Right? I mean, can't get much closer than that. There we go. <laughs> yes! Another mission accomplished with great success, cadet. While you were away, I gave Remy his first assignment. He's created an impressive buffet for the welcoming ceremony. <laughs> Don't worry, there'll be more than air tea and air crumpets. <laughs> I'll need you to place the buffet and don't forget to put on your uniform before we get before the welcoming ceremony. Oh, that's a very nice spread. Okay, 
Um, oh, okay, looks like we have to change into our outfit from before. Hmm. So let's try blue sweats. And um, let's see. Navy blue long sleeve. Okay. And we have to put back on. Hmm. Is it not the space helmet? Oh yes, this one, and this one. Mm -hmm. Okay, and for the furniture, we have this wonderful... Buffet. Put this right here. Looks good. Oh, look how wonderful. Okay, let's take our picture. And let's put our title. Nice. And we've got everybody. We have everybody. Okay. Wonderful. <laughs> hey, how you doing? <laughs> I'm doing good, thank you, sir. Congratulations, cadet. The welcoming ceremony was a huge success. Our newest recruits were there, everyone had fun, and seemed to enjoy the buffet. When, you know, when I come to this village, on a recon but you helped me find my place remember my past here and you helped me figure out what sort of hero the valley needs uh, I learned from you when I was a kid are you getting a bit teary eyed buzz well I can't really cry my eyes are made of durable plastic working with you has made me a better space ranger these angel which is why I think it's high time you got a new rank. I'm promoting you from cadet to fully commissioned space ranger. Aww, I'm so happy. Well, you deserve it. And since you're a space ranger now, you'll need this. Your very own jetpack. What? <gasps> Ooh, thank you. Definition of a hero. You. Oh, that was such a wonderful thing. Oh, and now we are back in our Space Ranger costume. <laughs> but now running around in here in the forest, it just seems so very, you know, free and airy. I mean, I didn't take completely everything out. Pretty close. But I wanted to leave, you know, some things, kind of like this log. I thought that this log was really cute. Because you can sit on it. Oh, look. When you're sitting outside, <gasps> you get energy. Oh, it doesn't matter. Oh, that is so wonderful. Mm -hmm. Yay, now we get full energy. Very nice. Oh, this is evolving. Very, very nice. It's a good thing that all we did was move that balloons a lot closer because I am not seeing very many of these flowers. Oh, there's one right here. Oh my goodness. Yeah, so if we had to come and look for more of those flowers, it would be very tough. Hmm. 
Hmm. Well, the raccoons are here. Whoa. Oh, goodness. I'm not gonna get them all. There's no way. They're scared. Scared. They're scattered way too far. Yep. There was no way. But I got a few. All right. So Buzz. I've completed my patrol. All is quiet in this quadrant. Oh, that's fantastic. Sir, um, let's hang out again later. Mission accomplished. Yes, it was. All right, we're gonna go try and feed some of these raccoons. Kristoff's just jamming out over there. <laughs> hmm. Hey, Kristoff, how are you today? Hi. Can I help you with something, Dis Angel? Nope. Do you need my advice on anything? Right, right, right. Uh, I'm hoping you can settle something for me. What would you think if someone told you they'd gotten engaged to someone they just met that day? Oh, you asked me that before. Hmm. Um, true love. Huh. What? You, you can't really get to know someone in just one day. What if he's secretly plotting to steal your kingdom? What if you hate the way he picks his nose? Um, hmm. That's a good point. It is a good point. Thank you. So long. So long. Well, hello, Mr. Raccoon. Are you going to just walk right up to us? And, wow. You made that so easy. <laughs> Here you go. Oh, very nice. Well, if the other raccoon would just be th that accommodating, that would be just wonderful. <laughs> He's sitting there waiting for more. No. <laughs> Hi. Would you like a blueberry? Mm -hmm. Nice. All right. Two, racco two raccoons down. All right. Let's come down this way. Let's go see what Moana has caught for us. And we can collect all our fish. And maybe we can feed some sea turtles and maybe some of the foxes. Moana. Can I grab some of this? Okay, so we don't have enough room at this moment, so let's empty off what we don't need. We can't wait to go sailing today. Oh, that's nice. Okay, we don't need that one, don't need that one. No, 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 and no, no. Hmm, okay. Let's, let's sell some of this stuff off. Hey, Goofy. Hey there. Hi. Can I sell this one for you? And you can have my seed. And all my garlic. And all this mint. Vanilla. Ginger. Mushrooms. And I don't need the blueberries anymore. Sounds like a fair trade. Mm. All right. Thank you. See well, you later. Nice. All right, I'll catch you in a bit. Hey, Moana. I'm here to collect the rest. All right, thank you. All right, so now, whoa. Let's go to our box. Okay. So, she gave us white sturgeon, which is great, but I found... Hmm that we get better results with salmon. So I'm gonna use the salmon and a couple pieces of seaweed. All right, let's see. Mm -hmm. Hey, Kristoff. <laughs> All right, let's see. Where are the turtles right now? 
Oh, there's one. Hi. Oh, you don't have to be scared. Come on out. Come on out. I've got something good for you. Come on. You can do it. Hi. Here is some seaweed just for you. Yeah. <gasps> Yay! We got the brown sea turtle now. Mm -hmm. Oh, what'd you drop? Oh, oh, what's this one? Hmm. Oh, what's a Wreck It Ralph memory? Nice. Okay. So we got you. Let's find the other one. There he is. Straight ahead. Mm. Hello. You don't have to be scared. You can come out. Come on. I got something good for you. You want some seaweed? Yeah. There you go. <laughs> oh. What'd you give us? Oh. Kind of looks like a magic mirror, maybe? That's a nice motif. Thank you. Alright, let's fast track all the way up here. Alright, let's see. Where are the little foxes? I guess while we're here, we can just collect a couple. Oh, there we go. Hi! Hi! Um, you're not hiding very hard. Stuck on a fountain. All right, where'd you go? I lost you. Hmm. Oh, there you are. Hmm. Hi. 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 Would you like a salmon? Hmm. Oh, very nice. Okay. Saw the little blue one over here. There he is. Hi. Hi. You wanna play? Salmon for you. Oh, an iron bar. Thank you. I appreciate that. I think I'll go. I'll ask Milky if he wants to. <laughs> you should do that, Goofy. So it looks like, in order for us to decorate up here, we're gonna have to really take out a lot of different things. more things and then okay let's go really quick over here to the forgotten land okay and let's make we need to make at least two five-star dishes, and I find that this Aradelian pickled herring is easy enough to do. 
because we get a lot of herring. We get a lot of lemons and a lot of <laughs> garlic and spices. And the only thing that we're, you know, you know, right at the 50 mark is onions. And we pick a lot of those up from Wally's garden. So, make two of them. So it's herring, lemon, onion, garlic, and any kind of seasoning. Okay. Five star meals. Cooking. Ooh, we finally made 80 five star meals. Very nice. Next one is 180. Okay. Black sticks. And so they're so hard to get a hold of. All right. Let's see. Where is our ravens? There we go. There's one right there. a very strange place, but okay. Sure. Halfway between the building and the rock and feeding the raven. Well, he seems to be happy about it, so it's all good. Nice. Alright. Alright, so now all we have to do is find the last raven. Oh, and an egg. Alright. other one. Would you like some of this? It's really yummy. It's pickled herring. Aridellian pickled herring. Yeah? Alright. Sounds great. And now the two of them are right there. <laughs> Crystal. Nice. Two crystals, it seems like. And I don't know that I necessarily need to have the same flowers from here to feed the hummingbirds. I think any flower will work. And if not, then we can find another one. Let's test it out. Hello. Hi. Can I give you... I got five of these. How about one of these? Do you like these kind of flowers? 
Yes. Nice. And you gave me two crystals too. Nice. Oh, this was very nice. I think the only things that we didn't feed today were the rabbits and the squirrels. And those ones are really easy to do. But I hope you enjoyed this episode. Come back and see us the next time on Disney Dreamlight Valley. Goodbye!